Hello YouTube, I am going to be filming again in the vehicle. So, I have some blue yarn here that is actually Red Heart Super Saver that I got at Walmart. And I am using a J size hook, 6 millimeter. And I am going to start a sock, a basic sock. So I'm not sure how much of this video I'll be able to show before I got to go back to work in 15 minutes. So you're going to make your slip stitch and then you are going to bring that chain, that needle in through that loop. You're going to chain three and to do that you yarn over, bring that needle through the loop, yarn over bring the needle through the loop, yarn over, and bring the needle through the loop. So once you have those three chains, you are going to yarn over, because I'm going to do a half double crochet, and go into that first loop. You're going to bring that yarn through so you have three loops on the hook. Yarn over again and bring through all three so that you still have one piece of uh, one string uh, one um, chain on that that needle so then you're going to again yarn over go into that same loop bring that that yarn through you'll have three on the hook again yarn over and bring through all three and that is what we call a half double crochet so now I've gone in twice and I'm going to do that uh, ten times so yarn over go in come out that's three, yarn over, go in, come out, that's four, yarn over, go in, come out, that's five, yarn over, go in, come out, that's six, yarn over, go in, come out, that's seven, and yarn over, go in, come out, that's eight, yarn over, go in, if you have this extra piece of yarn sticking out you can just work it in by putting it on top of like that and yarn over go in come out if not you can cut it off at the end yarn over go in come out and that is 10 so and I'm gonna pull that string tight so I have 10 half double crochets to make my circle and then I'm going to not yarn over just go into that next stitch here that single stitch you're gonna go in there yarn over and pull, uh, pull out and you'll have two on the loop and bring it through again so that you basically are doing a slip stitch and then you're gonna chain two you're gonna go into the same place where you single crochet so from here you're gonna go into that hole and then I'll put two half double crochets into that stitch and then I'm going to put two half double crochets into each stitch around and then I will see you guys when I get to the other side okay so I have half double crocheted into each stitch around and then to join where your slip stitch is going to be it's going to be at the top of where you made that first initial chain one or chain two I'm sorry so you're gonna go in through that top loop you're gonna yarn over pull through both and that's the slip stitch you're gonna chain two and then you're gonna go yarn over and go back into that same chain the same place where you made that chain to that same um, stitch you're going to half double crochet into that and then you're going to half double crochet into the next stitch half double crochet into the next stitch half double crochet into the next stitch I'm trying to get a look at how this is going to be because you don't want it to be too big, you know. And then, so I have three half double crochets in each, one half double crochet into each of the 
those next three loops those next three stitches and then I'm going to do two half double crochets into that fourth stitch and then again I'm going to go one half double crochet two half double crochet three half double crochet and then I'm gonna put two half double crochets into that fourth stitch and that's basically the pattern that I'm gonna use until I get to the other end and so what you do is again one half double crochet into each of the next three stitches and two half double crochets into your fourth stitch alright okay so I've made it to the end here and this is the wrong side this is the right side doesn't really matter if you look at well it does matter because this doesn't look cute from that end but um that's another story so anyway what you're going to do is again slip stitch at the top of that place where you started off that last slip stitch and then you're going to slip stitch and then chain two and then now for every row after this one you are going to go into that same stitch and do one half double crochet all the way around yarn over go into that next stitch and you're just going to go into each stitch all the way around you're going to make a half double crochet and that's the bottom of your uh, sock so you're going to do this for about 12 rounds and this is going to give you the shaping of your sock and it'll look like a little foot and then um, I'll try to see if I can add on to this video if not then I will do a separate video on how to finish the back of the shoe because it's everybody does it different in the first when I first started it didn't really look the way that I expected it to and now there are coming out a lot better so um, yeah so um, thanks for watching my video subscribe to my channel please like my uh, videos and also you can find me on Instagram under crochet misi m-i-s-i crochet m-i-s-i see ya